Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Rule the Waves 2 as Japan. <sighs> Last episode, we had uh, kind of a, I guess, like a mini midway around Truck uh, against the French, uh, where we did sink one of their carriers, one of their, uh, their light carriers, and uh, only took one torpedo hit to one of our fleet carriers uh, in return. Uh, so that actually worked out fairly well. Uh, we damaged some of their heavier ships, but it was uh, eh, not too big. They, they weren't able to, I guess, uh, exert control around truck. We were able to maintain that. Uh, even the uh, squadron in truck actually got some hits on some of their ships. That was, that was pretty good. Um, but yeah, we are continuing forward. We were able to build the brand new Zuiho class light aircraft carriers. So that's doing their working up in uh, Northeast Asia right now around the home islands, which France has abandoned. If that's the case, then I'm thinking uh, in Northeast Asia, Fuso is going to go to reserve to save some money. The more money we save, we can even go ahead and accelerate construction there. I don't think that actually helps. It's not going to shave any time off. We'll go through with that. It does mean we're not, like, full up with our ships, but we've got that deployed there. If it comes down to it, we could probably also send in one of our... Or, you know what? Instead of doing that, why don't we have the Fuso... Uh... Do we do that? Question. Fuso, okay, Fuso goes to reserve, and then the Haruna we could send down to Southeast Asia. Possibly. Are we still overdoing it in Southeast Asia in terms of our bases? Just barely. Yeah. We'll keep going with what we've got. All right. Well, really nothing else for us to do. Let's just go to the uh, the next turn. We've got a convoy attack here outside of Anam. It's a medium engagement. We'll accept that. Set priority for land-based aircraft in this battle. Suppress enemy airfields. Attack enemy ships near objective. Attack enemy ships in general. Attack enemy ships in general. Don't wanna don't wanna tie your hands behind your back, gentlemen. And this is just a pure. Destroyer Rush. Did plenty of this in the Italian uh, series. Okay, we, we do have radar. That is something we can use to our advantage here. So we're going to rush in and we're, we're hitting them. Okay. How long until... Oh, it's the middle of the night. We can use this to our advantage. We can skirt their patrols. Okay, that's their destroyers. They're going too quick for anything else. They might have radar of their own. I'm not sure. I want you... Ah, damn, I can't put them outside of that. I want you to... Now, stay on screen. Just gonna go this way for a while before making a turn. We'll plunge into the actual formation. Okay. Objective is to sink six transports. All right, here we go. Right across the bow. Torpedo rush. An immediate turn. Okay. 
turn back through. Okay. All right, straight back in, high speed. Okay. We're going to be going around. And back out of the formation. Looks like they're trying to get to Shane. Ah, oh, damn it. I forgot how this is supposed to be pronounced. I looked it up, but I completely forgot. All right, hit these two skirm- uh, these- uh, oh, we did sink six. Let's try and go for two more, just for the VP and the lulls. There we go. Back up. Those two are down. We've sank eight. He's straggle, and there's stragglers left behind. Let's see if we can cut down another formation. I know we're getting greedy. That's the form, that's their, is that their formation? Yeah, that's their actual combat formation. Okay. Let's circle back around here. get away from all of them. Come back around here and get out in front of the actual freighters and then uh, hit them one more time and we are just inside of an air gap of the... Uh, well, actually, no, that north one is not them. I want to make one more pass before the actual uh, morning hits. One more decent pass will secure. Ooh, they are good. Come on. Okay, one pass here. They have abandoned. There we go. Oh, yeah. Okay. I think that's as good as we're going to get. Start heading north and out. Ooh, one of our destroyers encountered a, a straggler. You. Damn it, I can't tell you to go back. Fall back, just get out of there. Damn it. I can't tell him to leave. He's just, that, that commander just, 
got overzealous. No to all. No. Okay. A single transport. A single transport made it through to their destination. We sank 15 transports that night. I don't think they got radar, and I think we're using that to the to the, uh, the best of our advantages. Yeah, a single merchant. A single merchant got through. And we had a minimal amount of fire traded between our two forces. That worked out amazingly well. Thank you. Give me that prestige point. Yep, Battle of the South China Sea. Take that. Our scientists made unexpected advances in AP projectiles. Good to know. So, increased muzzle velocity, gradual AP penetration improvement. Azuiho has, uh, yes, automatically make those. Enemy fleets dominate the seas around... Uh, okay. Mm. Uh, they sank three of our subs that month. Ooh, that was not good. They definitely won that month's trade war. Okay. When we got three, shouldn't be able to dominate the seas around anything. Ah, uh, they're just shuffling things around. Well, either way, we're doing we're doing our part. We're doing well. Uh, it's not gonna help. No, normal construction pace. Uh, let's see. Zuiho. You're still doing your working up, period. Let's see what air groups we assign to you. Or what the, uh, pencil pushers back in, uh, in, uh, oh, oh, in Tokyo assigned to you. So you've got two nine-plane Sentais, a dive bomber and fighter, an eight-plane Sentai of torpedo bombers, and another eight-plane dive bomber Sentai. It's not bad. It's a, it's a standard uh, deployment, I guess. Yeah, you took some hits, so you're out for a month. But other than that, you're actually doing okay. Doing all right so far. Okay, there's not really much else for us to do in between these. We just need to keep going forward. And uh, do we have anything we really want to take in terms of new planes... Flow plane scout, I'm okay with what it's got. Could go for a better medium bomber, though I do like the fact that it has good reliability. Our dive bomber doesn't. Quest aircraft proposals, let's go dive bomber. First priority, I want it to be tough, and I want it to be reliable. And we're going to see what it spits out at us. Other than that, though, we just need to keep going forward. I mean, we could theoretically put the Fuso back on to active. Doing so might make them no longer dominate the seas around uh, Japan. That'd be nice. All right. Ah. <sighs> Let's go to the next turn. Cruiser action. We're going to decline that. Enemy coastal raid. All right. Well, we can accept that. We've got the uh, we've got the air power. Attack enemy ships in general. Okay, it's a little bit overcast, but it should be okay. We do have an aircraft carrier division, which has the uh, Shuiko, or is it the Shikaku? Shikaku and the Kaga. So we'll see what we got. If it's an enemy coastal raid, that means they're going for some sort of... They're either going for merchants or they're going for an installation, but I don't see any installation nearby, so they're going for merchants. Alright, 
let's uh let's just do this i would like uh oh we have 11 and 11 and 13 Okay, we got a long time before nightfall. Just want to double check. Uh, where is L Carrier Division 11 and 13? Okay, yeah. No, all right, they're all together. Uh, all right, you, I want all of your bombers to ready. And then 13, I want all of yours to ready as well. Okay. See what scouts tell us. Oop. Unidentified target. Max speed. Max speed. Start heading down that way. Are these ready? They are. Okay, first strike from the Shikoku. We're going to have you target. Go somewhere right around here. And launch a strike. Yes, yes, go. We'll hold back the rest for right now. We'll see what they're coming at us with. Alright, I see heavy cruisers. Yep, I see heavy cruisers. All right, secondary strike from 13. I want you, 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 and you, as well as you, you, and you to target and go somewhere right around here and launch strike. Yes, 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 go. Light cruiser took a hit. Comes down to it, we'll do a, uh, the same thing we normally do and go in with the uh, with the suicide torpedoes with our destroyers. Line ahead, yes. Max speed. Line ahead. Max speed. Okay, the Zumo takes a hit. It is a modern ship, so we'll see what uh, what's your armor? Four inch belt. You're you packing twelve ten inches. What's the Zumo packing? Ten inches, ten of them. Okay. But ours are worse ten inches, if I recall. Okay. I want to see those naval strikes. Yeah, there's the naval strikes going in. Naval strike. Should also see naval strikes coming in from Fort Bayard soon. Because you've got 60 aircraft. I want to see heavy cruisers at the bottom of the sea. Right. Destroyers start screening because your lead ships are starting to take a pounding. And our light cruiser also took a pounding in the engine room and she's down. Ooh. Yeah, there goes two turrets. Two turrets of yours are down as well, my friend. As well as your superstructure is rotated a couple of degrees. Okay. Here's the naval strike going in. There's another naval strike going in through there.
All right, you lot. Ready. Let's get all of you ready as well. Lost track of the bombers. Hey, okay. Zumo's taking a lot of hits. Six medium hits. The Takawa's taking seven medium hits. Yeah, there you go. Should be going in on those heavy cruisers. You're off station there. Naval strikes. Okay, there go the torpedoes. Okay, we're breaking up the heavy cruiser line. There we go. That is a long line. <laughs> Heavy of, of uh, torpedoes going in on those cruisers. There we go. We finally got the air power going in. Start turning away here. Okay. Start turning back north now. Oh, yeah. Plenty of those. By the way, he almost got hit by multiple friendly torpedoes. It was very close. And 18 knots there. You pull out. Do you pull out as well? Oh, yeah. There goes all the naval strikes in on a couple of very, very much immobilized heavy cruisers. I want you to get hit by it as well, buddy. Oh, yeah. Heavy cruiser bomb hits. They're going in for you. Uh, let's also go ahead. You are all ready. It's not a huge strike. Right around there. Launch strike. Yes, yes, go. And then you. All of these planes that are ready. Again, it's not a lot, but even if we don't hit the mobile heavy cruiser, it will still hurt the immobilized ones. Because they are basically sitting ducks. Oh my god. Oh yeah. These guys are not doing so hot. This was not a good idea for them to try and attack Fort Bayard. Because <laughs> they are screwed. Heck, we're even going to send in some of these uh, destroyers that got hit. Uh, I do want to check who's the slow one. You, I want you to... Can we have you detach, maybe? How do I do that? I thought there was a way of doing it, but I think I've... No, I think I've imagined it. Okay. Oh yeah, there goes all them. Oh, they are going for the mobile one. I think. 
Nope. Still going for you. No, they did hit you, though. You are getting hit by bombs. Uh, I do want to check. Oh, you lot. Who's your, what's your lead ship? Cruiser Division. Where's the Cruiser Division at? Oh, yeah, they're hightailing it out of there, which I would expect them to do. We're going to double back. Oh, yeah. Unsighted gets hit by a torpedo, which means it's one of these. Oh, wow. You guys are not doing so hot. Go off of that. You're still good, so I want you to head back down. No longer turning together. Going in. Because if I recall, they do have above water torpedo reload. No, they're out. Never mind. They're out. Are you out? You've still got you've got one destroyer with something left on it. Check and see what do we got. Anything. You got some. Right there, let's ready a strike. Ready a strike, that gets us something. And you, you got torpedo bombers, some dive bombers. You've got some as well, you've all returned. Get all you to ready a strike. Right. There's those torpedo bombers, and they're going in for him, I think. Now is he finally pulling out? Okay, all of you are ready, so I want you to target down that way, and launch strike, yes, 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 and then you, everyone that's ready here, I want you to do the same, target somewhere right around there, and launch strike, yes, 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 yes. All right. Double back this way, because we do have some more. Okay, Kaga, you go that way. You start heading that way. We got these guys coming back towards these merchants, because they have a mission to knock out two transports. Oh, oh, they spotted him. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Yep, they're hitting him with bombs. There goes his engines. He's dead in the water. Dead in the water. It's a very stupid idea to attack Fort Bayard. <laughs> this, this place has got so many, uh, so many aircraft. Let's go that way. Stay from the broad. Stay away from the broadside of that destroyer. We're 
slowly clearing out all these enemies. Come on, little destroyer buddy. Sure, pick up survivors. They give us extra points. And illustrate how screwed they they were to make this strike. Okay. Yep, there goes the destroyer. Maybe that was a possibility. I think that's three heavy cruisers gone. Yes to all. Just have them enter the port after a good day's work. All right. Just got that little guy there stuck in the middle of nowhere. Okay, so we lost two auxiliaries and a destroyer, while destroying three heavy cruisers and three destroyers. Much, much better odds on our part. And apparently they had a single destroyer left, and they even said that they had a light cruise? Light carrier. Yep, they had a light carrier, but he did not partake in the operations. I wouldn't either, <laughs> to be fair. So that was a slaughter of an attack by the French, an ill-advised attack that resulted in the decimation of their heavy cruiser force, which is one of the few areas that they still hold a substantial advantage on us, by the way. So yeah, give me all those VP. Uh, yeah, give me that uh, notable, ba notable battle. Uh, the daring pilots of the 200, of the 200, 2,000th, 526, so the 25, 26s, uh, Sentai have racked up an impressive total of 15 bomb hits. Hey, nice. I don't know. Uh, and the 3344s, 16 bomb hits. The 3349s, 10 bomb hits. Uh, the 3350s, 11 bomb hits. My god, the enemy wants to... Uh, the army wants more resources to prepare for an offensive that will shift the strategic initiative the Prime Minister wants. Uh, no, no. We can't, we can't sacrifice any of our funding. We are a hair's breadth from having to, like, put some ships in mothballs to save money. So we're not going to do that. Uh, our submarine uh, SS... Uh, or our submarine I-39 is torpedoed and damaged a French battlecruiser. That worked out. And we lost a sub that month, and they got a lot more uh, VP from knocking out a lot more of our uh, merchants. Oh, damn. That places the French with only three heavy cruisers in the air in the combat zone now, uh, which cuts down on the heavy cruisers they can send up to Northeast Asia, which helps us out a lot. Like, if we check the Almanac, France has... They had 15 heavy cruisers. Now they're down to 12. We knocked that down by a substantial amount. Uh, even their destroyers are starting to show some problems like they are their tonnage wise are starting to like they, they're pretty old they're small destroyers what they've got in service huh we've got three more months for our next light carrier to come out is the Zuiho ready nope still on her working out uh and she's in southeast asia 
Did I deploy her already to Southeast Asia? I think I did, I guess. Huh. Well, it makes sense. Even though... Yeah, no, it makes sense. But looking at the time, that is definitely going to be the end of this episode. So yeah, things are going still very well uh, in this war so far. Uh, let's hope we can keep that going. But thank you for joining me for this episode. If you liked it, please leave a comment down below. Hit the like button if you want to support the channel. Hit the subscribe button down below as well as take a look at the description down below where I have links to my Discord and my Patreon page. I'll see all of you in the next episode. Bye. Bye. <laughs>